Welcome to Greg Ols TV Daily. Hope you're having a fantastic day. Uh, today's story is all about the black screen of death with the Samsung Galaxy Z Fold phones. Now, I have to admit, it's probably not going to happen on the Galaxy Z Fold 5. The reason for that is it's five generations in. It has much better build quality than any generation of Samsung Galaxy phones. And I think they've just fixed this issue. I, I looked through uh, online if this issue is having happening with Galaxy Z Fold 5 phones. I couldn't find it. I'm not saying it won't happen. I'm saying this is, the probability of it happening is a lot less than the previous generations of these phones. Now what I'm talking about is I saw this on Reddit and the post went like this and I just wanted to get the word out about it. Large screen goes black when I open it, but if I factory reset, I can see the front, uh, the screen loading up the Samsung logo. I have a Z Fold 4. I opened it up, have several times today after the last software update. It's just a black screen. The front screen still works and I've restarted and done a forced restart too. When the phone starts, I can see the gap. The re inside screen lights up with the Samsung logo. So the screen has powered up to be working fine is that in that respect any thoughts now and what happened and what the reason it's doing this is because the ribbon cables are becoming like detached or they're loose inside the phone and what's the fix for that well the fix is you're gonna have to either send it off to samsung which let's hope you have a warranty still which if it's a z fold 4 or older there's a high probability you probably don't unless you bought it really really late in its life cycle or that you have the insurance with the phone. And if you don't, you're gonna have to pay a lot of money to get this fixed, probably hundreds and hundreds of dollars. So you're kind of SOL in terms of what to do with that. You're gonna have to get it fixed though. There's nothing you could probably do unless you're a master uh, technician of some sort and you can open up the phone and potentially reattach the cables and do all of that, which it's probably a lot harder than it, than it, than it sounds uh, and, and more sensitive than it sounds too at that. So it's definitely a, an annoyance, but again, I think the Z Fold 5 has rectified that issues and I think the future generations of Samsung Galaxy Folds won't probably have this issue as well. The, the Fold 5 is really a, a great built phone, especially compared to the, the previous generations of they just They really did a great job with this in terms of its reliability and stability with the hardware itself really really good job but if you have a z fold 5 and you're having issues with it in the physical sense let us know in the comments down below have a great day we'll see you down the road peace